Hi guys, welcome back to my channel again. And today I am actually back with my 20 week pregnancy update. Oh, I know you guys are like, um, the last time you made one was like 14 weeks. So I'm sorry, when you are pregnant and you have a toddler, a two year old, it is sometimes very hard to stay consistent. I give it up for those moms that keep it coming every week because it is a process. Anyways, let's jump into the video. If you're here and you're new, welcome. If you're returning, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. So I got ultrasounds for you. So in my last pregnancy with my daughter, Ella, um, I had switched OB, OBGYN, um, but that OB I had took like, it was like, I felt like literally every week I was in for an ultrasound, but with this OB, it's so different. Like they only do like major marks for your ultrasound. And the only thing that I miss with my old one is that they did um, 3D ultrasound, but with this one, I don't get a 3D ultrasound, but I was able to do my 20 week, which they did an entire scan of my baby. And it was just great. He was being a little bit um, shy and hiding his face which was just a little bit, <laughs> it was funny, but it took a really long time. But like after like sitting in the room for like an hour, he finally showed a little bit of glimpse. But anyways, I'm gonna share it with you guys. So this is the 20 week ultrasound of my little baby bean. Look how big he is. So yeah, you're gonna get like, so when you go for your 20 week checkup, they're gonna give you like a ton of pictures and you just get to see that, have that moment where you get to see everything that's going on with your baby. They let you know if he's on track and my baby is on track. He is coming on a September, that day, that day said, he is coming. <laughs> um, let's get into the symptoms. Um, I've been feeling really tired lately. Uh, I've been going to the, I've been going to the bathroom like literally every five minutes I need to pee. I don't know what it is, uh, but yeah, it's annoying. <laughs> um, a lot of discharge, but I recommend that if it's summertime, because I'm pregnant during the summer, um, get you some panty liners. Even if it's winter, get you some panty liners. They will, they're great. Just get, just, just go to Walmart, get them, Amazon, whatever, get them. They're great. Um, that is a pregnancy hack right there. Um, another thing is uh bloating i guess i don't know um and what's weird is i don't know if any other mom is going through it but with me um my breast milk's dried up so i was i'm still nursing my daughter but i only nurse her at night and i just woke up one day and there's no breast milk. like she's nursing and there's no milk so i don't know i'm gonna call my obg this week and ask like hey what's going on i actually bought mother's milk from the supermarket to see if that could bring my breast milk breast milk back um if that's happening to any of you moms please let me know what's going on or if you have any advice on what to do let me know you know because it's just so weird i thought because everyone said it's fine to nurse while being pregnant so it's kind of weird um other than that um not really much going on. Uh, my skin was really breaking out going through my 14 weeks up, but then it stopped because I kind of stopped using it because any product that I would use, it would just make my face worse. But other than that, I just kind of stuck to one. Um, it was Noxzema. I just kept using that only and no other products. Um, so my breakouts, if you guys, I'm not wearing any like foundation or anything, just lipstick. Um, but yeah, my breakouts stop, which is great. So I don't know, maybe the 20 week is that mark where they're like, you know what, you know what, mommy, I'm going to make you look pretty or somewhat. Okay. Um, maternity clothes. Let's get into it. Yes. So my jeans no longer can fit me or button. Um, so I had to go shopping. I wanted to order some stuff from Shein, but my first experience wasn't the best. Um, so I've been going to Burlington, TJ Maxx, um, just buying piece by piece stuff, but I've been literally just buying a lot of dresses. <laughs> and then I look in my closet and I'm like, I don't have anything to wear. But yeah, anyways, I'd love to do a pregnancy haul. Like, let me know what maternity stores you guys shop at or what works for you because I need to know because I'm running out of options. All I have is leggings and leggings and sweatpants. And a bunch of dresses that I buy that because ever since you see Rihanna, you're like, I can wear whatever. And then when you put it on, you're like, 
I'm not Rihanna. So that's me right now. <laughs> um, but yeah, other than that is, um, yeah, everything's just been great. Mentally, I've just been getting up really excited. Like I can't wait to meet my baby boy. Um, I haven't chosen a name yet. I have a list and oh, I'm looking for my phone. Like I'm filming on my phone. There is an app that is literally like, okay, so it's, it's basically what my doctor, what my OB told me. Yeah, this app is like tender, but for naming babies. Cause me and my husband, we're like this with names. Like he'll throw a name at me and I'm like, no. Or I'll throw a name at him and he's like, no. So we can't pick a name and it's just driving me nuts. Cause I'm just like, I want to be able to like call him a name. And I've been calling him my names. And yeah, so anyway, so we're at that mark where we can't figure out a name. So my OBG told me about this name and app and we've been using it. So I keep swiping to find names. And then if I like something and my husband likes the same one, then we match. So I'll put that in the link below. It's pretty cool. So you guys could check it out and have fun just finding a name for your kid. Well, your baby. <laughs> um, so yeah, so that's where we're at. Everything else is great. Let me show you guys the bomb. Yeah, okay, <laughs> almost well. All right, so, and this is another thing I notice a lot of women are doing. Even I caught myself, I'm like, why is her stomach bigger? Or why is her stomach smaller? Everybody's baby bump is gonna grow at its own rate. Don't rush it, just enjoy the process. So anyway, so this is my bump. And I ate like maybe two hours ago. So this thing is growing. And I feel like your bump shows more when you wear certain things. But yeah, let me move back a little bit. This is the bump. See, I bought this little dress. It was so cheap at Ross for like eight bucks. And I thought, okay, it could be like a going out dress, but nah, I just wore it in the yard. Cause I don't, it makes the back of me look like a box and I don't like that. <laughs> so yeah. But yeah, that's the 20 week pregnancy bump. My stomach is, it's hardening up. Um, but I definitely have that black line going down in my belly, which is cool. And I forgot the most important thing before I end this video. Um, I feel little baby kicks. Yay. I feel them like every night. He's just like Ella, his sister. He literally starts, he wakes up at night and he has this thing. If I lay a certain way, like, especially on my belly, like just for two seconds, he'll start. And I'm like, Hey, and I'm like, you've been quiet the whole time. But as soon as I lay this way, you want to just start kicking me like crazy. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah. So I will see you guys in the next video. Hopefully. Maybe next week I'll make a 21 week pregnancy update. I don't know yet. It just depends, but I'm trying y'all. Thank you for watching my video. If you enjoy it, give me a thumbs up um, and subscribe. And let, like I said, let's share our experience and our growth together. I'm on IG, Mommy's Jade. <laughs> um, yeah, and comment below if you are the same week or if you're experiencing similar symptoms, let me know guys. And if you have baby names, Shout some out because I need some. <laughs> you guys have a great day. Thank you. Bye.